Here's what we're doing. We need a farm. We need to seal the basement somehow. Uh, and we need to find metal. And it's there's an asterisk next to find metal. And also uh, natty gas generators. So that'll be something that happens. I don't know if that'll happen today. Uh, but finding metals will be the hardest one because we just don't have a lot of metal. Like the, like we what we've seen on the uh, in the uh, asteroid that we've discovered so far. It does not look like we have a whole lot of metal. <laughs> so we might be starved for that, uh, which would suck. Which would suck. But yeah, let me see. So what's the first thing we should do? <sighs> first, let's go ahead and try to set up a farm. Because we have to get... Well, these guys are eating mush bars. <laughs> like, just mush bars. And I always punish these guys like that. Just continue, just continuous flow of mush bars. Um, yeah, we gotta, we gotta get them off of that and get them uh, in some real food. Um, let me see. We have tons of mealwood. That one just to collapse there. Uh, tons of mealwood. And I can see that they can't access the, uh, they can't access this in order to toss it or even get that. So let me go ahead and put one little block there if I can. We got a text by type. Yeah, we got to do. Okay. I'm just going to put one simple block. Make it out of whatever. So we should build that pretty quickly. Okay. Or tomorrow. It's fine. Um, we don't have any research or anything queued up because I kind of wanted to wait until we got everything else in order. This area over here seems like it might be a great place to start building out a farm. Just like a, you know, triple tier farm. We'll just do, uh, maybe we'll start with double tier and then, um, you know, meal wood and stuff like that. Man, mush bars probably taste like depression. <laughs> yeah, probably, actually. All right, so let's see. Let's go ahead and get, um, I want to seal this room off. But we should have at least a, uh, like a drain area to get carbon dioxide out. Or or we could just plant a couple oxyferns. Because we have oxyferns lying around still. There's one like right here actually. Uh, so we could probably get a couple oxyferns in there. And let it just kind of naturally cycle the air around in there. Uh, let me see. Do I want to start here? I know I'm going to dig this whole thing down. Oh yeah, that's right. I was going to do... Maybe no, 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 no. We could we could have the offset. I don't really like this offset. It kind of gets on my nerves a little bit, but I think I could go ahead and just trim the fat off here on the right hand side, and then I uh, clean that up accordingly. Uh, that water's filling up. Yeah, so let's go ahead and start here, and we'll make this. Uh, we'll make this priority one. That we don't build it anytime soon, and we'll just use igneous rock. Is fine. Actually, what do we have a whole lot of igneous rock? Okay, cool. It's like the only material we really have to build anything because we're so starved for everything else. Uh, let me see. And then what do I need height wise? Uh, if we're going to put, we're going to pipe things in. No, I don't think the meal woods even need water. Yeah. I don't think the meal woods even need water if I recall, but we should probably make it high enough. So that way, if we did need like pinch of pepper nut or whatever, we could do that. Uh, so let's just make it like four, just four bricks high is fine. And then we'll swap things out as needed. And then we'll do another one, four bricks high here. And then we'll figure out what we're going to do for the layout for the rest. So I think maybe we should maybe leave it open for now. Or because the temperature here is actually fine. Let me go and let these guys move around here. Like the temperature here is great. I mean, this is perfect for growing shit. Like I hardly need to do anything. I hardly need to actually enclose it. So why don't we go and actually just do that? <laughs> just like not even bother enclosing it. Uh, we'll just build. Let me see. We'll do fill. We'll do farm tile. Put a farm tile straight across here. Yeah, let's make a whole bottom out of farm tiles. Seems fine. And then, what should I do over here with this side? Is that enough food? Oh, I'll so many questions already. Let's go ahead and do that. Mm -mm -mm -mm. So we'll farm tile this. Plenty of room in here again. If I need to flip one of these and put a pinch of pepper nut, we can. But even though I probably wouldn't put a pinch of pepper nut in, like right next to the meal woods, but I'd want this, the basic structure to at least be um, flexible. I really hate that these two things are like kind of offset here, but. Maybe it's okay. Maybe it's okay. No, actually. No, let's plan ahead. We'll plan ahead. There you go. Uh, you need two tiles for the farm. What was this? You need uh, two tiles for the farm thing that... God damn, hold on a second. This thing is... Uh... There. <laughs> I couldn't see the tech. The chat was covered on my screen by half of uh, OBS there. 
There we go. Um, let me see. Da -da -da -da. Food, farm tile. It's good. And then we'll just put a one here and a one here. Again, these are just kind of markers for now, just to get things started. And then we'll fill things in. Oh, we're actually we need a priority fix on this. Yeah, let's make it like five. At the very least, we now we can get started. Um, you need two tiles for the farm thing that helps you grow your crop. Oh, that's right. Yeah, that's right. There is that. Oh, that's right. And closing the room also gives you a bonus or whatever. Uh, what does that sound? Okay. Usually that's a not a good sound. Oh, I guess we're going to see what our achievements are here. It's not wrong. Have a duplicate eat any we have un we have not done basically any achievements because we've we have not really used any of the uh science shit that we've unlocked. The food station. Uh god, what is that? It's probably under food. <laughs> Electric grill planter box. Maybe we should put the fridge under the fridge, the cooking area somewhere around here. Like, maybe down here at the bottom, that way, you know, there's just more room here for, uh, it keeps the food accessible, but also, if there's carbon dioxide build up, whatever, like, at least it's not gonna be crowding the, uh, food, uh, you know, creation. It's gonna be just crowding the, uh, or the food growing, it's gonna be crowding the, uh, uh, food cooking, which we could take care of easily. Uh, it's under stations, yeah, I probably don't have it yet then. Let me take a look and see. Probably under food, solid material, power and food. Yeah, here it is right here at the farm station. This thing is pretty sick, so maybe we'll go ahead and actually get that started there. What is the priorities on these guys? Uh, five and, uh, five. So we'll make those five for now. Because I have to get water from over here, so it's kind of a trek to get water. I was going to build a fire fireman's pole so that we could get up and down pretty easily. But we don't have the metal. <laughs> like, everything is like is just hinged on the fact that we just don't have metal, um, which is a problem. And I also wonder if these oxyferns are going to be able to crank through this carbon dioxide. We created this carbon dioxide mess because we were running the uh, <laughs> the wood burner. <laughs> Insufficient resources, lumber. Are we actually out of lumber? No, we have plenty of lumber. They just haven't been, they haven't delivered it yet. We have 58,000 lumber. Is that number right? I guess so. Wow. Huh. What up, Hawaiian? Yeah, wow. Uh, that's unexpected. But for right now, like I said, we're just going to get Mealwoods growing. And then we'll build on this and figure out how we're going to do uh, the rest of the base. And actually, I still want to cut out all of the non abyssalite rocks everywhere, clean things up, like all this should probably eventually go. This will just keep, you know, the Abyssal Light does a pretty good job of insulating on its own, like you can see on here. does a pretty good job, so uh, I don't want to tap into that and lose some of that natural insulation. Although up here we could probably afford to get rid of some of it. Uh, I mean, there's plenty of Abyssal Light here that we could just take and use for other purposes, just to open this up if we need to use it for anything else. But for right now, this is build food stuff. What's up, Dazzle? Yeah. Here we go. Let's go and get him started here. Mia would see. Yeah, fucking a thousand of these things. Plant. And then copy settings. Let's do them all. Plenty of overhead here for whatever we want to put, you know, up here. Uh, like I said, we could get... We could actually put another layer of... Uh, of plants here if we wanted to just sacrifice that. You know, maybe we should just do that just to get as we start here. Hold on, what's wrong with uh, Martha? Food poisoning. This is the mush bar problem. <laughs> they should be eating mush fries and nothing else. And actually, maybe we should get that started sooner rather than later. We don't have a power source <laughs> still, uh, but we could at the very least, well, we could actually run a wire from here and just that'll, that'll run it. But we could at least get the kitchen area started. Uh, the cooking area started. Ah, don't get high on your own supply. I want you to be, people play this makes me realize my organizational skills and layouts are terrible. Really? I still feel that way. <laughs> I'm on everything. I try, I try to think my way through some of this stuff, but at the same time, it's kind of like, eh. 
Okay, Martha needs to take a day off because uh, I read that when somebody gets uh, food poisoning, it, it actually is a con compounding issue where they will... Let me go and do this. So they're already weak. They're at like 75% of their typical stamina, but they will work to 100%. And then what they'll end up doing is um, hurting their back. And then long after their food poisoning is worn off, their stamina is not recovered. They still, their back still hurts. And so it ends up just being a problem overall. So it's better to just, you know, to just lock them out of doing any kind of work for just a couple days. Wow, they actually finished that already. Nice. Okay, the mush bar thing needs to stop. <laughs> Let's let them continue doing their thing. Meanwhile, we're gonna we're gonna correct this uh, mush bar issue. Let's put one here and put one here. Some marker here, and then we're gonna wish insulate this all the way down. Whoa! That sounds like it's coming from the right, which is so weird, creepy. Uh, is that actually? Yeah. Hmm. I wonder if I should climb down here and get that oxifern out of there. I don't care if carbon dioxide builds up in here. We up with this and clean it up. Actually, let's have them, uh... Oh, they already set the harvest. Oh, there's an arbitrary right there, too. Hmm. What if we just dig all this stuff up? To uproot. And let's make these, like, nines. Let's make the... Oops, that was not the one I wanted to do. Let's make all these nines. I don't think a lot of this is going to be accessible here soon. So I also want to have them clean up this area, so that way we're not... Is that two steps? It is. So what was the, um... You've been reading about... Oh, yeah, why? Well, I, I, I read the subreddit. I read the subreddit, so... <laughs> we could get, we could take another person on. I think Donis was the last person that uh, we wanted. Let me see. Caregiver increased medicine, farts frequently, he's a vomiter, and a binge eater. Okay, not yet. <laughs> I don't like any of these. Uh, let's go and get a pip squeak. I know they're annoying, but I mean, let's just have them. Just I don't know. Oh, oh, they're, they're stuck for a second there. Uh, oh, they are stuck. Actually, they can't get down here. Let me go and deconstruct this. Make that right now. There we go. That way, they could go down and collect all this stuff and move it over. As far as no one's head's gotten stuck yet. Hold on. Just don't block those because I want them to clean this mess up before they, you know, before they go and <laughs> block themselves in. But yeah, the uh, subreddit is full of pretty good information. Like lots of people that just, you know, they just share their experiences and it's like, oh, this, this is such and such happened when I was doing blank. And I'm just like, damn, I do, I do that all the time. <laughs> like, for example, mush bars, they're like, Every mush bar, even if you make mush bars out of, uh, out of clean material, like germ-free material, it will still, it will still have 1,000 food poisoning germs. Isn't that crazy? Did not know that. Let me see, uh, food. So we want to get, let's get the grill going. The electric grill. Oh yeah. So make like a little kitchen or something like that, kitchen area. And we'll put the, uh, we have to have a washroom, so that'll be coming up, and which is going to be super easy because we have water right here, so we'll be able to put a washroom in pretty quickly. Uh, refrigerator, we may make that accessible. Should they wash hands before going to the fridge or going in and out of the fridge? That's tough. I don't know. Micro station, so this is going to require material we don't have. This is the problem! We just don't have... Materials! We just don't have materials! <sighs> What's that? Do the, uh, do the doors poop on in them? Do the, the rules poop on? Digi, what are these, what is this sentence you're trying to make here? <laughs> what, what are you saying? Chris, oh, autocomplete. <laughs> yeah, um... Yeah, I don't know. I don't know why. They just, they just don't. They just don't, uh, apply there. Wash basin, sink. Oh, I can't even make a fucking sink. Oh god, and a wash basin. That's just a pain in the ass. I have to constantly fill it up. Ah. <sighs> well, I'll let them continue cleaning here. Let's speed things up. 
And then what we'll do is we'll dismantle the mush bar maker thing here. We'll get some of that metal out. The mush bar maker. That's basically what it is, really. <laughs> but we do need to rebuild it over here, so... We need to get this. It's already, it's already taken apart, good. Let me see. And then we can put uh, food... Right here. I, I don't know where I'm gonna get metal. I really don't know where I'm gonna get metal, guys. Like, I mean, look, metal. Like, we have access to some. And I don't want to tap into this metal, this gold amalgam yet because it's so good. But man, just, just not a lot of metal overall. I guess we could go up here and just start tapping into this iron ore and just make a lot of shit out of iron. But I, I, I also feel like that's a bit of a waste, but I mean, we don't have a choice really. Uh, it looks like there's a whole bunch in this strip right here. We could probably go over here and get some of the, Oh, that's just the aluminum. Yeah, let's get all that. Whoops. Okay, wrong button. Got the wrong button. Yeah, look at him go. Look at him go. Nice. Yeah. And then probably have him go down here and do this because they can't reach otherwise. One, two, three, four. What are they doing? Oh, it's downtime right now. Right before bed. Yeah, we'll just open all this up. They have the, uh, they have the means to do so. And then we'll do this. I keep on hitting the wrong button. There we go. Look at where we go. Look at him go. Now let's trap him in here. Quickly, quickly, quick, 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 quick. Perfect. Oh, he fell down. Well, that's not what I wanted to do. <laughs> I wanted to keep him trapped so that way we could go in here and clean all this up, but but he got out. Okay, damn it. Oh, good. We got that. Okay, so now we have metal. Now we can build stuff. Oh, this is great. Yeah, let's just open all this up. There's no point not to. Open this up. Good. Let me get this. Which I believe they can reach from the top and the bottom. Let's do that. Let's see. Yeah, this stuff's not built yet. But hey, look, we already got stuff growing. Farms will be easy to get together. Just time is all we need. Alright, get to work. Let's go. Let's go. What we got? A pip egg, a briar seed, and we have tidying, researching, decorating. Oh, and a night owl. God damn, this just screams Donis all over. Like all over. Huh. Let me see. Decrease calories, binge eater, sticker bomber. No, let's do it. Let's do it. Welcome, new person. I know, bottomless stomach. We'll just try to keep him happy. <laughs> can they reach that? Yeah, they can. Good. Oh, man, it's beautiful. Should I have him dig all this up, too? Yeah, I think so. Just open this up. Completely. I'll we'll eventually go through and do that, but I think for now, this is a good... Okay, so now we have materials. Build stuff. So let's do it. They're still cleaning up over here, which is good. We're running at, like, insane speed right now. Did I get my 50 picture? I don't think so. Let's go ahead and do it now. Let me see. Uh, options. Da -da 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 -da. There's a game. And then crank this all the way up. Super big picture. Resume. So it's going to stall a little bit here. I'm on to I cycle 700. I'm sitting in tons of refined gold copper, but lack ore. So I had to make everything out of metal and plastic. Yeah. That's my problem right now, Aaron, is I just don't have a whole lot of metal to work with just to get, just to start with. Um, so yeah, <laughs> it's going to very quickly become a problem. Um, I'm also filling up my storage uh, units too. You yikes. Look all this open air. All this abyss light everywhere though, keeping everything nice and cool. We will have to dig into all this. I think all basically everything, everything inside of this green zone, we're gonna basically core. <laughs> we're gonna empty all of this out uh, eventually. You can see we already have some heat kind of seeping in from the bottom here, and this is what I wanted to try to avoid as best as I could, which is kind of tough because you know this carbon dioxide builds up pretty fast. And what is wrong with these guys? Irrigation. Uh it's out of water. Okay. I knew this day was would come. Uh so we need to 
flip a, let's do this, let's deconstruct this tile here. We'll do this stat. And then what we'll do is we'll put a water, boop, that happens right away. Look at that, a bottle emptier right here. And this is gonna be for just regular ass water. And then we'll have them just continually pump water in here. We'll have them do an errand where they're just moving water from that point to here. Uh, let me see. Yeah, 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 plenty of water in here. And we're getting more too by the moment, by the minute, so that's great. Good. Oh, this, they're not gonna build this anytime soon. That's the one. But we do need, we do need these machines working though. <laughs> Let's make this a nine enable auto bottle and it's gonna be for water. Good. So they'll, they will move everything from this point to this point as soon as they're done doing uh, this cleanup chore here, which is cleanup chore is pretty important. So we want that to happen. Uh, harvest ready, harvest Aaron. Oh boy. We should make these like eights maybe. Yeah, right now there's sixes. Uh, well, I wanted the... Oh, this is fine. Whatever. <sighs> Insufficient oxygen generation. Probably right now, yes, because I don't have a whole lot of... Uh... Oh god, this bottom... these bottom bucks are getting swarmed. Yeah, we do have to clean up... We have to clean up this air. I wonder if we should... Put one... Carbon... Was it carbon skimmer or whatever it's called? I always forget what that thing's called. Let me see oxygen. Carbon skim. Oh, hey! <laughs> so, anyways, yeah, we should get some of that and uh, and put it down here and just let it work off of this these existing pipes. Just like work off these existing pipes and uh, get the water clean or get the air clean and just just put it. We put a sensor on sensor down here just to let it run periodically, right? Just let it run until it's clean and then turns off. Because this, we can't have this. This buildup is getting to be a little too much. We a little bit too much. Yeah. So let's go ahead and uh, get that up. Power. We're gonna overload. We're gonna overload this for sure. <laughs> we're 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 pushing it, man. Conductive wire. Uh, God, I mean, I don't want to spend my aluminium on that. We'll replace this wire later. It's fine. Let me see. Plumbing, uh, obviously, is going to need liquid some sort, probably sort of liquid bridge. It's going to need uh, clean water going in, dirt water going out. So how do I want to do that? We'll steal from there. And we will put it back over here. And then we'll put insulated pipe. Insulated pipe everywhere. There we go. So that'll, that'll take care of that problem. The only, the only other problem is that we won't have lumber. Or power until we get these things going, which we should do today. It is on the list. We have farm, seal, basement, find metal, <laughs> find metal. That's gonna be a tough one. Uh, and natty gas gens. So. Yeah, it's it's gonna it's gonna happen. Let's just get this thing going. <laughs> it's never gonna get built. Everything nines. Boom, baby. Who that? Hammer of wrath. How? Uh, as for last year, I'm going to you about the legendary episodes. Happy 19 months. Glad only has been piquing your interest again. Me too. And yes, I know, I know. I do have the, that folder of, uh, of episodes I need to figure out how I'm going to re-release those. Let's see. Algae. Oh, I can always use more algae. I already have a person who's going to do that. Oh, you know what? I uh, wasn't... Uh, Cory... Wasn't he a night owl? Let's slow things down a little bit. Would you like... Okay, I'm just flying on myself then. Woovy. By the way, somebody asked if I have a med bay. I do not have a med bay. He's Donis. Here he is. Isn't Donis a... Uh, bio. Night Owl. Alright, so Night Shift. Night Shift. We'll put uh, uh, Buffy and... Uh, and Cory on the same schedule here. Now, so let's get Martha off of the... Martha's fine now. <laughs> Martha could go back to the day shift. <laughs> Let's see, Donis. Oh, oh nice, they put a little, um, little thing there. And you know, Martha actually prefers to wake up early, so maybe we should make a third schedule here, and this will be the, the early... The early bird. Special here. There we go. And that'll get him in and out of the bathroom. Let's do... Downtime here... Yeah, so I'll keep... There's a little... There's a good amount of overlap there. Keep people separate. Bath time. 
At the end of the day, beginning of the day, probably beginning of the day. No, end of the day. Watch the germs off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Watch the germs off. Germs off. Uh, that gives him. Martha gives him. See, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. So he has an extra hour of sleep. Let's go ahead and give him an extra hour of downtime now. Work. There we go. And that's going to be for Martha. The early riser. Good. <sighs> Carbon's game with a water sieve on its own water loop. Run as long as you got sand regularly. Yeah, I think I have a good amount of sand. Let me see. Filtration medium. Yeah, I have 27 tons. If that's one thing I think I have a lot of in this map so far is sand. Um, let's go and take a look, though. I don't want to make any assumptions here. Yeah, that's a good amount of sand. And there's probably more elsewhere. 27 tons is a lot. So, and I'm really not really using it for anything else. So, yeah, I think it'll be... It'll work out. Uh, cool, and it's already going. It's not mixing the water, right? Nope, that's working actually perfectly. Fantastic. We're gonna create <laughs> probably more carbon that we're uh, more carbon dioxide that we're actually cleaning up. Uh, I'm curious though. Let me see. Let's see heat production, lumber. Let me see. What is it exhausting here? Properties. Thermal capacity, melting points. Does it not say? Let's see, energy consumed, wood power, power consumables, batteries, 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 circuit overview, status. Burns lumber, produce power, produces carbon dioxide. Does it tell me how much carbon dioxide it puts out? Maybe we'll hover over it. Heat production. Huh. Does it really not say something? It says somewhere, I'm sure. For the extra dirty water from the carbon skimmer. We'll see once this. We have a pretty good amount of buffer here, so. <clears throat> we'll see what happens. We have to get the... We we, we really do have to get the... Um, God, they're still cleaning up over here. It's crazy. Ooh, why are they... Why does it say storage unavailable? Oh, I just ran out of space. Lord. And these things are not working either. Okay. We have food source sources. We're running low on food, though, because we're not really making anything with it. So we should... Go back over here. The byproduct of a natural of a natural gas generator is dirty water, right? Um so if the but it doesn't go out, it just pulls and I think it just pulls. It doesn't actually like go anywhere useful. <laughs> like it doesn't go into a pipe or anything like that where you could go and drip it somewhere else. Uh so we have to actually pump it out over here. Which we could probably do with a miniature pump eventually, but we do have to still have to create a space for it to operate. Um, Natty Gas Gens, I want to say they also put out a good amount of heat, but we don't really have much of a choice because we don't have like a, like a whole lot of metal to choose from. To like make, I don't even know if we can make one actually. That should be the first step. Can we afford it? Yes, we can. Okay, good. Natty Gas Generator. Produces carbon dioxide and polluted water. So yeah, we should put it somewhere where we can uh, pump that stuff out easily. And I'm gonna, gonna go ahead and say, let's just put it right here for now. <laughs> Master plan community. So we'll put it right there. And then we'll get um, heavy watt wire. We'll run that all the way across. Do I have, Jesus, see, I mean, just barely enough to make even just heavy watt wire. This is gonna be a catastrophe. None of this stuff is running at the same time, so all this stuff should be fine. The carbon skimmer is the biggest user right now. This thing supports one kilowatt, I think. Uh, these are P1. Yeah, so that's never going to get done. We'll make it a five for now. And we have to figure out how to get the gas from there down here and how we want to do it. Do I want to open this up and have it go straight across? Which might be a good idea because there is gas pooling in here. So maybe we should go ahead and actually get that started. We'll make that a five. Make it out of the thing we have the most of. We'll bring this down. And we'll just basically have them cut straight across here. There we go. And it probably won't even pull that well because well we'll open it up a little bit that way we'll just kind of filter some of that out then we have pipes interchangeable an interchange of pipes going in and out oh actually uh i did kind of make this oh we could just jump it right here actually it's fine kind of wonky but Which, uh, when you play at fast speed, all the gases are hypnotizing. Like, just watching them, like, kind of cycle around and everything. Like, that's... Visually appealing. It's vis visual ASMR. VSMR? I don't know. But yeah, we gotta get this thing going. 
They're still cleaning up, which they sh No, they're not cleaning up, actually. Let's stop this. VRSMR. <laughs> oh, good. They're running water over here. It's what we need. Perfect. Gonna come over here. Just dump. Just dump. Just dump one or two in there. We're gonna top. Get this whole thing topped off here. Growth. No irrigation. Body temperature. Oh, body temperature now, huh? Oh, the water is hot. What does it need? Oh my god. The water is too hot. Hmm. <sighs> That's a problem, dudes. Because that means I need an aqua tuner. And if I need aqua tuner, that means I need a lot more power. Um, because I do have to cool this water. And I did say before that, you know, I'm gonna have to cool the water because it's coming straight from the steam thing. But I, I was thinking nothing that I'm doing really needs cool water. But now I see that is a lie. The water, you know, water is too hot because it's all coming from the uh, the cool steam vent. So all this water coming down here is 190 degrees. It gets mixed in with this 150 degrees, and it just ends up being too hot for the plants to survive. So I'm bumping water, I'm pumping water into the system, and they're not. Um, and I'm just basically superheating these things. So they're probably going to actually uproot themselves shortly. And then a pip's going to come by and plant some shit like an asshole. Uh, so yeah, we do need to pump some cool water through there. And I think that's going to be, yeah, we have to put an aqua tuner down somewhere. So let's see. That is utility, I believe. Thermo, thermo aqua tuner. God, I can only make out of one material. That's all I have. Starvation. What? That's weird. Somebody's schedule's messed up. Uh, so we'll put one there. Just one should do the trick, because we can just loop it in on itself. I, keep, I swear I keep seeing. Uh, and then we can also, if we want to later put... Oh, there's an ice e fan, an ice maker. Converts water into ice. I wonder if we should... Does it get ice and then drop it in there? God. That'd be a bitch. You can't just tell them just to drop something somewhere, unfortunately. Like, I would say, grab a piece of ice and just drop it in the water, but you can't. So yeah, we'll have to stop with that for a minute until we get this water cooled. And to get that water cooled, um... I don't think this wire is gonna do the job, but... <laughs> it's not gonna do the job. Oh, man. We'll have to pump it out of here, get it into here. We don't need this pump actually pumped in, pumping into wherever it's going right now. We don't need that right now, so... Uh, we could go ahead and actually probably just snip... No, we do need the water. Oh, you know what? We do need that eventually. Um, we'll just get rid of the connection here. To here. And then we'll just have the, we'll have the water just go down here. Just drip it in, I guess. Hmm. Yeah, we could just put maybe like right here, or right here. Oh no, because we need that separation right there. Yeah, we'll just put. There's a drip right there, and it'll just continually drip until it's full. And then once it reaches max, it should stop. So we shouldn't have any overflow or anything like that. But the water coming out of this should be cool. <sighs> should. Slow heating, uh, over heat temperature, ceramic over heat temperature, plus 360. I'm saving that ceramic for a rainy day. Uh, starvation again. What is going on? Okay, let me see. So water goes out, water goes in. Water goes out. God, do I build the loop now? I think it knocks it down like 30 something degrees. Let's do this. We'll come over here and we'll come up. And we're going to put a drip right there. And we're just going to use this just to measure how cool it makes the water. And so we have to sit and cycle on itself over and over again until we get through all the damn water. Uh, we will, but I just want to see after it leaves Aqua Tuner how much it is. And then uh, then we'll connect it between these two if this, if it's uh, sufficient. Oh, man. Oh good, some of this material that they're actually cleaning up. We don't have storage for anything, but... Is there a puff in here? What is he dropping? What is that? He dropped a blob of something. It was blue. Fry mushroom! Let's go ahead and get some fried mushroom in here. We should pick it up pretty quickly. 
Boom, there it goes. This is only, these batteries are only running the oxygen diffuser right now. We're very quickly approaching needing to get more. <laughs> more of a lot of stuff. Oh, really? I can't do that there? Oh, that's fine. That's fine. I can just put a gas. Airflow tile. Right there. And then we're going to get the piping so we can get the ventilation down here. God, do I even have the materials to do this? I don't even know. I do. Okay. Oh, it's igneous rock. Yeah, I have plenty of that. Uh, so that has nowhere to go, so we're going to go down. We'll go down alongside here. God, it's ugly. Hold on. I could just go up, 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 and then go over like that. There we go. And then this is the output, which I believe is uh, carbon dioxide, right? Oh, I could just run that to space. <laughs> That's what I should do with that. Run that bitch out to space. It's not It's not a very long trip. I mean, it's, it'll take a minute to, uh, to run that pipe, but I mean, fucking worth. Let me see. Ventilation, gas bridge, and then, yeah. I like some space water. This is just to get the, uh, the gas output. And polluted water. So it's got, oh, bitch, no, we can't. We can't fucking put it there. Because the water, the polluted water drips. It drips. I just fucking said it, too. I said it fucking drips. And I totally built this in the just the dumbest spot. Ah. <sighs> Yeah. Fuck. Boom, baby. Gurmew, 15 months. Thank you so much, Gurmew. Appreciate that. What do I do? <laughs> I think what I need to do is just cut this right here, put mesh tiles going to the left, and then just let that dirty water pool down here, and I'll just siphon it up, or I'll create like a little pool somewhere to, to siphon that up. Um, but yeah, I think for right now, mesh tile is going to be the answer. Boom, I can't baby. even build that many of them, actually, so... Oh, man. Carnage! Been away for a month, but I kept my streak! Ten months! First time seeing your new setup. The lighting is amazing. Thank you so much! Yeah, new setup is freaking great, man. There's all kinds of shit we could do with it. Different camera angles and everything, which is pretty cool. I play with mods. Yeah, I have quite a few. Mostly, like, uh, uh, just nice-to-haves. Nothing too crazy. Quality of life stuff. Okay, uh, so we don't have a lot of metal, so do I want to sacrifice, what, like a 10 or something to go across here? What is this brine down here? Brine and hydrogen. Do I repurpose one of these rooms? <laughs> Temperature down here is pretty warm, isn't it? Yeah, I don't want to tap into that at all, actually. Do I have those small pumps researched, actually? Uh, they require plastic. Oh, God, I'm not even close. Mini gas pump, mini liquid pump. Draws a small amount of liquid and runs through pipes. Must be submitted. And I think you need plastic to make this. I'm going to go ahead and get them started on this. Oh, that's right. I think I have the drain mob put in. I totally forgot. I, I, yeah, you're right. And I think I actually have it. I might even have it researched. Drain. Oh, my God. <laughs> Mind games, thank you so much for reminding me that I had a thing. <laughs> oh, what, what, what a difference this is going to make. Oh my God. Um, it's kind of a funky shape, but I'm guessing I could probably just put it right here, maybe. And then I'll do the job. We'll see in a minute. Build it now. I might have to put like a mesh right here or something like that. Just kind of. Get everything in there, but yeah, I totally forgot about that, man. Oh, what a difference. Okay, so this is a problem now, but, 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 does it count? It does count as a solid. Oh, that's great. Although I do think that it's going to drip somewhere in the middle here, so let me go ahead and put one mesh tile right here. This saves me so much. This saves, saves me so much. Oh my god. Thank you for reminding me, my games. I appreciate that so much. Um, great. <laughs> it's fucking super. Good, now we can get some cool water. Somehow, eventually. All of this is trying to get cool water down here so we can keep our, uh, keep this carbon dioxide level lower. We haven't even tackled the food issue. 
We don't have any actual- you know what, we actually- they're eating straight up m just mealwood, which is fine, I guess. Mealwood meat. And let them chew on that for a bit, they'll be fine. Uh, I see they're working on this. Looks like they're working on this. Can't reach this up here, so let's go ahead and, uh, build a ladder here. Okay. Can they build over the thing? No, they can't. Okay. Well, I want the arbitrary still. Mm, and they can reach the rest, yeah. Wait, what is, uh... That's not gonna... They're not gonna undo the tree, right? No, what is this? Oh, the harvest. <laughs> no, we're good. At least they can't get food poisoning from that? Yeah, I don't think so. But they're not washing their hands, like, ever, so... <laughs> so, eventually... Eventually, they will have, uh, they'll run into, uh... A problem there. All right, good. So now we have the gas going in. We don't have a place to pump out that carbon dioxide. We can probably just pump it right out here. Just pump it. Uh, we have to get this going somewhere. So let's get this drip set up. And this, we probably need to make this out of regular liquid pipe, I think, because it doesn't matter what the, the, it's gonna come out of fixed temperature anyways. And so if it ends up absorbing some of the heat from this area, that's fine. I'm sure whatever comes out is gonna be lower than with the, the vicinity. Uh, although, what I will do is run it across here instead. And then down here into the, the land of the forgotten here. And let's actually not do this like that. I want them freaking out over trying to do that right now. It's amazing how much garbage I have all over the place. Like, there's just so much crap. 37,000 calories. We have to keep an eye on that because I don't know if this food supply that's just growing is going to be enough. And I actually wonder if I should set up another just to continue. God damn. Fine. Build that thing right now. Uh, but yeah, just to get dirt. Yeah. Just so we have plenty of just natural food growing. I don't want to tap into that. Like I said, I want to keep that as separate as I can. And not tap into the uh, abyssalite. This abyssalite here is fine because there's another layer up here that we could work with. <laughs> I don't think this garbage content for future Mike B. That's right. Tomorrow me will take care of that. Let's see. So gas pipe. We still have the gas pipe coming out of here. So we'll just make something simple just to get it out. Uh, ventilation, gas pipe, insulated gas pipe. And we'll just pump it out right here. Oh man, the drain. I, I remember when I, I, I picked that up too and I was just kind of like, I'm definitely going to need, need this because of natural gas generators. And I totally forgot that I had it installed. <laughs> they built that pipe already. Oh, no, not quite. I guess we'll get to this in a minute. Oh, it's waiting for aluminum ore. God, can I make this out of something else? Can I make it out of dirt? No. Man. You see how quickly this aluminum ore is just disappearing? God. I just don't have any metal. Turn off the fan. There we go. But this is good because we'll be able to take advantage of these natural gas geysers that are going off right now, but we're not able to actually use them. I did say I was going to eventually make that <laughs> this gas bank go out to space. We'll, we'll do that. But right now, we'll just want to we'll just get this kind of cleared up here. Get the get power over here. Uh, get uh, get the aqua tuner running. Get the water cooled here. This is not helping, but it's also helping at the same time. But look how hot it is. 157 degrees. Fuck. Copper ore. Oh my god, please. I have 75 keys available. I'm getting 2,000 more. Yes, give me all of it. We'll eventually refine that into usable copper. Ooh, running low on the food. Are these guys planting shit? You motherfuckers. God, 
I fuck I, I I love the, these these things are so great because they they just kind of naturally go around and uh, and take care of some of this stuff for you. But at the same time, they're planting arbitraries and oxyferns up here that don't belong. They just don't. Copy settings. All right. So all we need is this, and then this machine's gonna kick on. It's gonna start running. Um, it's not gonna turn off by itself though. Uh, I don't have, I have automation here, but I don't know how much auto, yeah, well, I can run at least some simple set systems. We'll see. That carbon skimmer, it, it is, but you know what though? It's cleaning things up. Look how clean it is around here. Yeah. Also, the water sieve needs filtration. You can see it's filling up over here on this side. I was thinking maybe I could run this drain into the water sieve, but then I would, I, I would have to deal with uh, overpressurizing these pipes, right? I could build like a pressure bypass system using automation, probably hydro sensor, clock sensor, liquid element sensor, weight plate. Hmm. No, 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 we'll wait. We'll wait and see. Okay, it's, it's moving now. Wrong element. Oh, that's right. Oh, I said I was just going to deal with that. Oh, kind. I forgot. I was like, yeah, I'll just deal with it. It's just the first little bit. And it's true. It's just the first little bit that's going to have just some nasty shit in it. But the fact that it's going to cost me aluminum ore to do this now. I'm just going to let it happen. 